Imagine this. A patient managing essential tremor with primidone suddenly develops atrial fibrillation and heart failure. Now the doctor prescribes Eliquis. How does primidone interact with Eliquis and could this change the management plan? Stay as we explore these questions and surprising facts about primidone. Let's break down this real-life scenario. A patient in their 70s has been taking primidone for years for essential tremor, recently diagnosed with atrial fibrillation and congestive heart failure. This raises critical questions about drug interactions and safety. Primidone is an anticonvulsant medication used to treat seizures and essential tremor. It's a first-line treatment for essential tremor, characterized by involuntary shaking, often affecting the hands. Primidone converts into phenobarbital and phenylethylmalonamide. These metabolites enhance gabergic activity in the central nervous system, stabilizing neural activity and reducing tremors. Primidone was developed as an anticonvulsant in the mid-20th century. Doctors discovered its effectiveness in treating essential tremor when patients reported reduced tremors during epilepsy treatment. This off-label use soon became mainstream, showcasing how medical treatments can evolve. In essential tremor, abnormal brain activity leads to uncontrollable shaking. Primidone reduces neuron excitability, stabilizing and decreasing tremors. Studies show up to 70% of patients improve significantly with primidone. How does primidone interact with Eliquis, an anticoagulant for atrial fibrillation? Primidone induces cytochrome P450 enzymes, especially CYP3A4. This speeds up Eliquis metabolism, lowering its blood levels and reducing efficacy. For atrial fibrillation patients, this increases stroke risk. Does primidone activate or inhibit CYP450 enzymes? Primidone induces CYP450 enzymes, notably CYP3A4 and CYP2C9, affecting drug metabolism and interactions. What should patients and providers do? For patients taking both primidone and Eliquis, close monitoring is essential. Adjustments to dosing or considering alternative anticoagulants may be necessary. Always consult with your healthcare provider before making any changes. Important facts and statistics. Primidone is highly effective in reducing essential tremor symptoms, with studies showing significant tremor reduction in most patients. Essential tremor affects about 7 million people in the United States, making it more common than Parkinson's disease. Drug interactions involving CYP450 enzymes are significant, underscoring the importance of understanding these interactions. Did you know primidone is related to barbiturates but has fewer sedative effects? This makes it a valuable treatment for essential tremor. Should you be worried if taking primidone for essential tremor and newly prescribed Eliquis for AFib? Yes, discuss this with your doctor. The interaction could impact Eliquis's effectiveness and adjustments may be needed. Thanks for watching. If this video helped, like, subscribe, and comment below with your questions or experiences. Knowledge is power in managing your health. Watch our other videos to learn more about managing essential tremor.